We are doing free code camp, JavaScript algos and data structures. We are in challenge 61 in the basic JavaScript course. And today we are going to use comparison with the strict equality operator. Um, so this is basically just saying strict equality as in triple equal sign, not just the, sing, uh, the double equal sign, um, is the strict equality operator. So the previous lesson we learned about the double equal sign, um, which is the equality operator. Now we are learning about the strict equality operator. So unlike the equality operator, which attempts to convert both values being compared to a common type, the strict equality operator does not perform a type conversion. Uh, so basically it's saying it is strict, it will compare the values and the data types. They both have to match for it to be true. Um, if the data types are different, it will not attempt to convert those and it will be false, even if they are the same uh, value converted. If they're not the same data type, will not be true. So we're going to use the strict equality operator in the if statement so that the function re will return equal if val is strictly equal to 7, as in the integer 7. So this is just like the last challenge we did. Currently, we're just testing if uh, we're in this function. We're testing if val, meaning if value exists, if it's not undefined, we'll hit this. And if uh, it is undefined, it will not meet this condition. So thusly, it will execute not equal but we want to check strict equality using triple equals and seven. So this test output should return false. Well, should return not equal because this is false and it will not execute this code block. And then if we pass in a seven here, it should return equal. So if we console log this guy, we should see not equal, not equal so far and then if we add a 7 here we should see equal because that does match type if we change this the data type if we change this with the uh, to a string it will not be equal because this is not an integer but if we used um, single equal sign as in the equality operator not the strict equality operator it is converting this string to a number seven, which is making this return true. But we want to use strict comparison, strict equality, so it is not equal until it is the same data type. And that's all we should have to do for this one. Hope that made sense, and I hope to see you guys in the next lesson.